You've seen the three peasant human tower rush. But have you seen the three peon orc tower rush? I don't think you would have seen it, would you? It's not a trick the Jedi's would show you. Because the Jedi's know that this build order sucks. It's not even a light side, dark side. It just sucks. Well, let's try it out. And it's against human here as well. The Jedi's aren't new. Hey, Grubby. I just watched the solo pot. The most hilarious game I've ever seen. That was a nice game. Cheers, dude. Versus Militia. It's Jedi, singular and plural. Oh, I see. Got an expert. Is Peon only plus two heroes legit? Well, it's about twice as good as Peon only plus one hero. You know what? We don't have to build the towers in vision to kill his base. We can make it a very sequential thing. Who said they have to be in vision? Not me. Did you say it? It's in vision, damn it. But he's going a uh, rifle tactic. Maybe he won't notice. The longer no militia are coming this way, the better. You know what? I feel like the optimal strategy is actually for him to ignore it. After all, he could get all this XP and all this investment out of the way for free. What's the problem? Just let it finish and then kill it with your first two rifles, Paladin and all your militia. Rather than early on immediately messing up your economy, you just let it finish and then you get free kill. And then you go tower the orc on the other side of the map. Well, there it is. I like how much information they stay. <laughs> Let's get some uh, lumber. <laughs> Wait, he didn't see it? I come from the darkness of your pit. See ya, AJ. You failed your Don't waste my time. So he really didn't see them then. Wait, oh, oh no, defend footies. Spikes. We need spikes! Oh no! <laughs> He's too fast! But on the other hand, Paladin can't get through either. Hi, Grubby. Be following you since early Dub C3 heydays. Been a dotard since 2013. Love that you are getting into the game less than three. Yo, cheers. We have cleave, it's perfect. No, no, this. Oh my god! The absolute god! Scorched earth tactics.
Did he just miss? I think he meant to maybe holy light my pitter. Or maybe I just accidentally BM'd him. Did you miss, Bob? Um, let's make voodoo lounge. No, I think he forgot that you can holy light pit lord. Rifles. Those two rifles tell me he's probably staying at tier one. I want to say, most likely. Can I? I really wish I was able to walk through here, man. All he needs to do is detect the tier two and get more tires. That's it. What a foolish boy. What a foolish boy. This is like uh, chess. It's a real time strategy, but it plays out like a turn based game. I use the Russian opener towers, and now he's thinking what kind of defense he's going to use. We need more peons. <laughs> it's a very slow attack. Technically, he needed to have attacked into this at all yet. It hasn't done anything yet, you know what I mean? It has literally not threatened his progression. You know what this is a symbolism for? Reading the news, for the most part. You read the news, something terrible happened somewhere, now you feel worse. But your world hasn't changed. He should not have read this news. If he had not read it, his day would be fine. Doesn't mean it doesn't affect others or you can't have empathy for it. The moment he starts running, we can rain a fire in. Perfect hero for it, actually. Maybe I should have gone Rain of Fire.
Is Spirit Link a counter to Cleave? No, Cleave is a counter to Spirit Link. Think of it like this. Can you heal a wound that you don't have? Spirit Link, like all support abilities, is dealing with a problem. The problem is burst damage. And the solution is you spread your own damage. So if you're dealing with spread damage, you need spread healing, like heal scroll. Not to spread it more. Let's go get Pitlord again. Why not Firestorm always farms? Yeah, I could actually. But I wanted to deal with the Mortar problem. Anyone that hits the, the town bell is panicking. You hit the town bell, it's a panic. Oh shit, no Voodoo Launch anymore. Luckily we still had a mana pot. Anyway, I have Rain of Fire level 1. It's really not that good to kill all his farms with. He doesn't have much left. Dude, I animation cancel accidentally. I'm not sure you want to surround Brutillus. Can I kill them fast enough though? Maybe I can deny myself. <laughs> Does he die? This is typically how Night Elves in 2004 played. Just revi, 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 revi. Make again and again. Oh, can he, can, can he kill his own... I was thinking maybe he could kill his own paladin if I let the mortar self fire. Like by putting a peel next to his paladin. But he's still obsessed with attacking the tower. As well, he should be. I could rematch him and do the same strat again. <laughs> Be funny actually to do the same thing three towers again. Or we could do like try hard. Yeah, this is uh, I would like to play again against the same thing. Oh, come on. Blizzard, please. Let me harass my opponents after the game. All right. GG. I can't add him either. Look, thank you, Blizzard. It doesn't even have the thing people you played recently. Oh, wait, it does. Oh. I'll let you know next time if we rematched him. If you want to know if we did and see the game, you gotta sub to the grub. See you then, soldier.